Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to our channel, guys. If you guys are new, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on those post notifications so you don't miss a video. All right, today we're gonna be taking you guys through a Kevin Porter Jr. workout. Guard for the Houston Rockets. Lefty, um, played at USC. So we're gonna take you guys, you guys asked for this in our YouTube comments. So we're gonna give you a full workout of his. Um, four different drills that you guys can do in order to play more like Kevin Porter and develop some of the skills that make him such a great NBA player. So let's get into that workout. First thing we're gonna start off with here is we're gonna start off with one of the moves that I saw him do a lot was a slow skip between the legs laterally and then he goes with a fast between the legs the other way and gets downhill and makes a play at the rim. Kevin Porter Jr. finishes a lot of his finishes off one foot so that's what we're going to work on here a slow where i try to skip outside that defender's hips with the between the legs i get him to shift i come back the other way and then i'm jumping off of one foot and extending it at the basket okay so let's show you what that looks like here we're slow fast and then we're off one foot he's a lefty so i decided to use my left hand you guys can mix up whether you want to finish off one or two feet but main thing is Play with pace here, fast, oh, off one foot again, scoring it, okay? I'm going, you know, as slow, but a comfortable speed on my first between the legs. This is just a setup to see if he moves. Obviously, if he doesn't move, we would just take off right. But if he shifts over, we change our speed, we come back this way, and we score it at the basket. Okay, I'll show you guys two more going the other way, where I skip uh, right to left first and then come back. Watch also, notice my body position. When I'm skipping slow, I'm kind of high. And then when I decide to change speeds and go fast, I drop down low. If I were to stay high going fast, I'm probably gonna lose that ball. So I'm high, low, drop down. One foot finish at the basket. Show you guys one more. I want you guys to complete five going right, five going left. High, relax, drop. Oh. Working on different finishes all off one foot. Okay, now we're gonna think, imagine yourself in a ball screen situation. So you're dribbling your man down, you've got heavy pressure, ball screen has come to set on your side. What we're gonna work on is a pound, hip swivel to back this guy off, right? So if he's crowding me, crowding me, crowding me, I wanna pound, that's gonna make that guy jump that way because it looks like I'm gonna go to the basket, okay? From there, we're gonna open up our hips. First read we're gonna make, is when we open up our hips and that left foot hits, we're gonna fake coming off that screen with an in and out dribble, boom, and then we're gonna get to the basket, score off two feet, okay? So this is a good, good move to have when you're trying to set up a ball screen and there's a lot of pressure. So we drive him down, boom, quick in and out, hey! Scoring off two feet at the basket. This also can be used without a ball screen, just in trying to set up your offense and you're bringing the ball down, you got heavy pressure, back that guy up, Take it with the in and out, and then score it at the basket. Okay, show you guys one more. Watch as I pound, I step my left foot forward. Boom, as my left foot hits, I'm selling the in and out with my eyes going towards the screen or going back towards the middle. Left foot hits, that's when the ball hits for that in and out, okay? Timing super important on this move. All right, so here we go, driving down. Back him up, in and out, oh! finish at the basket. Now I'm gonna show you where we actually go off the screen and or just do a crossover if we have no ball screen. So now when I go, I'm pounding, backing up, getting some space away from that guy, get some space. Now I'm gonna cross, whether that's coming off the screen or just attacking. Now we're gonna get into a floater in the middle. So bring him down, punch, open, and we'll floater right in the middle. Okay, this could be a one foot float, two foot float, whatever you want. Just really work on ball and foot, hit at the same time, punch and throw that shoulder, open up, and then get into a quick crossover. All right, here we go, dribbling down, punch, cross, float game. There it is, one more right here. Okay, make sure that crossover is quick. Make sure you get space away from this guy on this punch, cross, oh, and floater, okay. Let me just show you one of each on this side real quick. It's gonna be the same exact thing. Now my dribble and my right foot are gonna hit at the same time, acting like I'm going to the basket. That backs him up, right foot comes back. I'm in and out, scored at the basket, okay? Main thing important with this is make sure you use your eyes to get to the middle. Boom. In and out, 
oh score it at the basket okay now i'll show you guys one where we do the crossover all right here we go taking him down punch cross hey float tur at the basket boom last thing we're going to work out work on here is kevin porter plays the wing a lot so when he gets into these closeout situations where a man drives it and he catches it he'll use a quick shot fake on that guy he'll jab to back that guy up and then he replaces his feet and shoots that three right so if you have a closeout and the guy actually does a pretty good job of closing out right he doesn't jump or fly by you give him the shot fake to see if he jumps he doesn't jump so you sell drive backs him up immediately get that foot back underneath you and knock down your three so we'll spin shot fake jab back underneath me knock down the shot okay show you guys two more of those watch we want to make sure that when we do this jab we shot fake ball wants to come up a little bit right i don't want to raise out of my stance too much right so we want to move that ball here sell jab back knock down the shot okay show you guys one more and then uh i want you guys to make seven reps of this on each wing okay keep this uh the same pivot foot your strong pivot foot jab foot back knock down the shot all right so we'll do i'll show you guys one or two on this side same thing here i'm still i'm a right-handed player so i'm going to have my left as my pivot foot i'm not going to probably ever shot fake and jab with my left foot and bring it back it's not wrong to work on but you're probably not going to do it in a game so i would just stay with your strong foot working on that it's unfortunate shot fake replace knock it down boom Thank you guys so much for watching this Kevin Porter Jr. workout. If you guys did enjoy it, go ahead and leave a like and a comment down below. Uh, thank you guys so much for your support. Again, we have merch, we have programs, and we have, um, we have merch, and we have programs. And yeah, so if you guys are interested in supporting that G2G brand, uh, we greatly appreciate all the support that we've gotten so far. Thank you guys so much. Comment down below which video you guys want to see next. We'll make sure to keep bringing you guys that great content. Every little way up, you can see the bar raise and I Lift it up like I raise my hands I don't want to miss my chance On this earth, I'ma give it all I got But I know what it looks like first glance That I do it all for the paper No, I do this all for the savior Wish you knew my heart like God knows my heart He knows I'm praying for all of my haters This goes out to all the creators Who've been making music for Jesus Just make sure that music's amazing I quit wasting my time and energy I'm in the industry that just say time and impatience Say content new cadence Hey, being complacent I gotta stop being anxious I get excited to see where it takes it I'm just a man in the making Like Adam and even the